guys? What's going on, guys? Welcome back to my channel. Ruben here for another video, guys. How's everybody doing today at home? It's Tuesday. It's a great day, guys. I'm sitting right here on the sand, right by the water. Getting a bit of a, a little bit of sun. It's a little bit chilly, but um, still a nice day, guys. It's all right. So I'm just sitting here doing a little meditation. I just got back from the gym. Got me an awesome workout. You guys know how we do it. We don't skip workout days, baby. And uh, yeah, you know, just uh, improving, guys. Improving daily. Improving daily, guys. This never ends. You never stop improving in life. Sorry about that, I had to fix the, the camera a little bit. So, yeah, just doing a little meditation, about 15, 10, 15 minutes. That's all you really need. A little bit chilly though. <laughs> it's pretty cold. But uh, that's all right, you know what I'm saying? Got my little sweater. And uh, it's relaxing, you know. Taking some time to uh, reflect on the on the day, you know, whatever. Just relaxing the mind, quiet the mind, having some time to yourself to think, relax. Got me a nice workout, you know. It's good to. Uh, you gotta get your body moving. You know what I'm saying? Like when you uh, when you stretch and exercise, you release good endorphins in your brain, uh, good chemicals, make you feel good for the rest of your day. It, it improves your mood, how you feel by yourself. Uh, you know, changes your body chemistry. Your hormones, your, your good, your feel-good hormones in your in your brain, and uh, you know it's, it's you're building yourself confidence. Believe it or not, and this might sound like like crazy, but. Whenever I, I take the time to go to the gym and I go in there, you know, I, I, I come out with my workouts on the fly. I, like, I don't write nothing, like there's no plan. I just go in, I know I'm gonna do something. You know, uh, whatever comes to mind, uh, whatever I'm inspired to do that, day, I just start working out. Whether it's chest, arms, whatever, sometimes I do the whole body, all kinds of exercise, I mix it up. And man, let me tell you, when I leave the gym, something's different about me every single time. That's how much you improve. Like, you may not see it. I think other people see it more than you sometimes. I think a lot of times other people see the improvement that we fail to see in ourselves. Like, you, you're changing. When I, I go in there and I when I come out, it's like something's different, something changed, in, in like little by little. Even if it's like, like I said, one percent. Like I said in one of my past videos, even if it's one percent, that still change. Change is change. It's change for the better. You get stronger, more resilient. Your willpower. 
your confidence. You improve. Everything improves. You're taking time to build your self-discipline. You're disciplining yourself. Working out is not just working out to look good and impress, you know. No. It's also mental health. Emotional well health. It, 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 your confidence, it improves you in so many areas. Because you're taking the high road. You're doing you're doing something that only a certain percentage of the population is willing to do, which is get out of their comfort zone. Whenever you get out of your, you force yourself to get out of the comfort zone and you do something uncomfortable, like working out and uh, meditating, uh, anything that's self-improvement, that, but it's hard, it's difficult. And you willingly put yourself in, in those difficult situations, you come out the other side. Every time you come out the other side, and you, you, it gives you a sense of accomplishment. Like you know you did, you took the time of your day, an hour, even if it's an hour, an hour and a half, to go in that gym and, and, and do a workout, do a, a, an exercise where you're sweating and you're, you're working out your muscles and, and you come out that gym and you're like, I did it, you know, like another day, like it was hard, but I pushed through it. And let me tell you, a lot of times I don't feel like working out. But that's where you built that discipline. You, you're making yourself do something uncomfortable that you know is good for you, but it's hard, but you do it anyway. Because you know it's going to pay off in the long run. Or else, why, why else do people work out? Because they know it's going to pay off in the long run, health-wise. It has so many benefits. It, it improves your life in so many other areas. Because when you're disciplined, and you're in control of your thoughts, of your mind, your emotions, there's nothing you cannot accomplish. Nothing. It's out of reach. There's no such thing as impossible. When you train yourself to do those uncomfortable things that you know are going to uh, bring a, a good return on investment. See, working out, you can never, ever lose when you invest in yourself. Remember that. It, it's just not possible. You can never, ever lose when you invest in yourself. And that's what working out is. You're investing in yourself. An hour a day, let's say, two hours. 15 minutes to get to the gym, 15 minutes back. An hour and a half, maybe two hours of working out. You're, in, you're investing in yourself for the future. You know that in six months, a year, two years, five years, however long you stick to those those workout routines, it's going to pay off in the long run. Mental-wise, mental health, physical health, emotional health, uh, you know, your cholesterol improves, your body fat goes down, and you feel better about yourself. Your cup, it, it's so many things that improve when you know you, you're good. You're good. Like you know you look good, you feel good. You know, it's just awesome. I see myself working out until the day I die, to be honest. It's just become a part of me. It's part of my identity, it's part of who I am. Even if they close out all the gyms in the world, I'll go out for a run. I'll do push-ups on the beach or on, on a bench. I, I'll find something to lift. I don't care. I don't, I, I don't don't need a gym. I go to the gym because you have access to more equipment and stuff like that. But I can always get a workout anywhere. <laughs> That's one thing I learned in jail. 
I learned how to work out with whatever. <laughs> Used to make bags and all kinds of things to lift and fill, fill it up with water and all kinds of shit. And you got you a workout. And then, you know, we come out of jail. I heard people come out of jail and they look all swole and shit. They, they're in there and they have nothing but time but to, to, to concentrate and working out. But why not do the same thing out here? Dedicate that time to go in and get that, get that money. You know? Get those benefits.